So ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Gary Street. Yeah! Hey, thank you very much. I'd like to thank a chance slide with 30 for being out here today. So instead of bombing for 20 people, I'll be bombing for thousands. So thanks a lot. Um, I'm feeling pretty good today. I got uh, some new uh, shoe insoles. Dr. Scholes. I used to use the uh, Dr. Kevorkian uh, insoles, but uh, I think made my feet go to sleep. <laughs> For the new people here, Kilo and uh, the Eagle Radio Station, uh, the coffee screen is all right if you miss the toilet. So, uh, had a, um, a toilet's, uh, you know the worst, the one thing is worse than going into your bathroom and sitting in a cold toilet seat. It's going in a public, uh, it's going into it's going into a public restroom that's not a warm one. <laughs> so women are a little, when making decisions, women are a little more, a little more emotional. I think they really, they're hard on their, on their, on their sleeve. And guys, of course, are more an analytical, black and white. For instance, a man will say, two plus two equals four. A woman might say, two plus two could equal five if you would just apply yourself. <laughs> but we're all, uh, we all come with baggage. Women come with baggage. Men come with baggage. And, uh, um, you know, I'm just trying to find somebody with a carry-on. <laughs> I mean, somebody can fit in the uh, overhead compartment of life, that's all I'm doing. I've been doing news for 25 years, and so one thing I can't understand is why we vote for County Corner. I think we're supposed to have some kind of knowledge of this. I mean, we all know he's got a scalpel and a dead body, but that's about as much as we know about the, this kind of job. Um, you know, I, I, have you ever seen a County, a county Corner uh, debate? <laughs> You know, I pledge that if I am elected, El Paso County Corner, I will recycle the bombing fluid, save us all a lot of money, we'll uh, make the guy look good in the uh, open casket funeral, and uh, when he's done, we'll just suck it right out from under. It's uh, not easy being a county corner. Um, I can imagine it's a smelly job, but uh, um, these folks uh, are, are good people, and you have to be kind of smart to be uh, a member of uh, this this uh, kind of work. Uh, uh, I don't I don't think they have to be uh, Mensa smart. Um, by the way, is anybody from Mensa? Anybody a member of Mensa here? That was a waste of ten seconds. I should have. <laughs> Noah Webster came up with the first American dictionary. And I was wondering, how do you arrive at doing something like that? What makes you uh, decide that you want to uh, come up with a dictionary? The first one in America. Uh, probably involved a drunken house party, but... Uh, <laughs> yeah, no, we're not going to play Twister again. We played Twister the last three times we've been out here tonight. We're gonna, here's what we're going to do. We're going to get a piece of paper, and we're going to get a pencil, and we're going to write down every word we've ever heard before. And then we're going to write out a, a description of what that word means. And I don't know why I think this is funny, but uh, but okay. yeah, on top of that, we're going to make the words in alphabetical order. <laughs> oh, shit. That goes in front of sheep. Put that down. That goes in closing. Um, Somebody asked me the other day if I thought I was going to go to heaven. And I said, well, if God is grading on the curve, <laughs> if God is grading on the curve, this guy is golden. <laughs> he's, he's <been> around. <laughs> and uh, they say you can't take it with you, and I'm not planning to take it with me. I want to take one thing with me as I go six feet under its uh, cell phone. If you need to reach me, let it ring. If I pick up, grab a shovel. Thank you very much. Thank you.